Hello everyone, welcome to the first episode of Boot and Bend, a show where we hit up a boot sale, otherwise known as a flea market, and uh, we pick up some items, take them back to the workshop, hopefully transform them into something different, something interesting. Um, we are by no means uh, experts, <laughs> we're just experimenting, um, so if you're new as well, hopefully this will give you a bit of uh, an insight and maybe you'll start tinkering yourself. Um, if you are already a tinkerer, uh, <laughs> I'll apologize in advance for our terrible soldering skills. <laughs> but yeah, other than that, um, it's COVID times, so we're having to wear the mask at the boot sale. And yeah, I think that's about it. We'd really, really appreciate your feedback. Um, consider this like a pilot episode. Tell us what you don't like, tell us what you wanna see more of. Um, and the next episodes will adapt to that. But yeah, let's go see if we can find something decent. Let's go hit some boot sales. It's like the old bargain horn going off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right there. Train's really involved. What is it? Oh shit, I didn't see that. Yeah, How man. much? 18 on that one. I'll do Stop. 12 on the other one. Let's see. I'll do 2 for 25. Oh. 2 for 25. <laughs> I don't think I can use that. But this is fucking amazing. We used the, uh, the old wick at the rocket base. Yeah, yeah. For signal, uh, signal testing, isn't it? Yeah. I don't think I've got any use for this one. Don't worry. It's just an impendent thing, right? Yeah. How much for that? 18. <laughs> Go on. 25 normally, but not a boot sale, I'm never going to do it. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Beautiful, mate. You sure, eh? That's fine. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? <laughs> Trying to <fly. laughs> Load them up. <laughs> you want this as well? No, I'm not going to polish any rocks. <laughs> We're all right for the rock polisher. Play it at the wrong speed, play yeah, it backwards, yeah. all that sort of stuff. Now, how do I get into this? Well, open, I think. Yeah. Could do, you're right. Stick with it. That's it, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't want to subject you to that. Wings of love. love. Wings of love. What a load. <laughs> yeah, yes, that's it. It's all right. One of the hinges. It's got a weird hinge on it. It's to all be right. honest, we'll probably remove the front of that anyway. Yeah. So you're gonna what you're gonna butcher that, are you? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> we'll take a tape like this. Yeah. We'll cut us a single loop of tape out of it. Yeah. And then it just plays on us forever oh, and ever right. and ever. You're no, obviously you mean, DJ day or something. More producers. Ah, producers, like, yeah. We yeah. sample a lot of stuff, record yeah. a lot of stuff. Oh, that's great. And we make a lot of stuff out of old yeah. technology. I mean, the, 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 uh, you got the earphones as well. Yeah, do you want them? Well, I wouldn't if you don't want them. I'm not going to use them, mate. Thanks, cheers. Thank you very much. Thank you, much obliged. I didn't say 30, so I just said 20, because 20 should be alright. you know if it works? Uh, I don't know, honestly. <laughs> so I won't say it works if I don't know. But it must be work, because it was in the garage about one year. What do you reckon, Brad? I mean, it's really worth it. Yeah. yeah. It's just the we want it. <laughs> you got more money in it? If it's broken, <laughs> I'm coming back next week <laughs> and you're going to give me a fibre pack. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was shaking his head. <laughs> Cheers, man. <laughs> nice. He probably was like, fuck. If I had said 30, then I could have sold it for 20 easy right now. But now I've got these two weird twins trying to... <laughs> <laughs> Alarm clock. 
Do you reckon it's worth it just for the case? How much that that? Com combined. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. How much for these two? How much? About five for both of them. What's going on that one? <laughs> Uh, the, the, the Pioneer uh, <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. I'm confused. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> what did you think? I thought it was just the top thing, the one top bit. I told you that you ain't gonna want to sell it individually. <laughs> yeah, but I thought he was gonna sell the little bit for six quid. Like, do you know what I mean? I was like, that's the reason I price for just one of the like. Look at the whole. <laughs> There's a tape coming out of it. What? <laughs> There's a tape <laughs> trying to eject right now. Do not eject. There's an actual tape in it. Yeah. <laughs> the tape says live and heavy. <laughs> oh lord. <laughs> what do we do then? One side at a time? Work all the way back up. Mm, yeah. There's quite a lot going on. Eyes in, mate. Practice. That's so much. I mean, you know, like, oh, yeah. I was just doing it. It's not my phone. It's an old one. Yeah. I bet it's wicked. I, I bet you it's 70. Oh, it's not too heavy. How much for the oscillator, right. mate? Oscilloscope. Oscilloscope, 20 quid. It does work, apparently. I <laughs> know, well, uh, you know, they, all the, the old stuff does. Yeah, yeah. I know. That's why we're trying That's to That's why it. we're still, yeah. I still usually sell a lot it. of this to the props department, you know. Yeah. All the old electronic stuff, they buy it in droves. That's cheap, I mean. That, that is pretty cheap. Yeah. yeah. That's nice. Anything in the bags at the bottom, there's 50 pence, three for a pound. How much are you selling the uh, sheet of piano for? Um, the front one was 45, I'll take 40 for it. Okay. We're going to back away from that. Yeah. <laughs> well, we've got an input for the drum coat. How much for the little Casio, mate? That one? 10 yeah. pounds. Is it tested? I haven't tied it now, mate. No. I've got no reason to believe it doesn't work. Rusted battery. It's not a bad one. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It's got a bob there. Yeah. It's in a few bamboo ones yeah. of these. Oh, right. Three notes? Yeah. What have we got? 100 tones. Found. Film in that. I'm filming film. now. Film mm. that. Right. So this is the hoard, and we're just gonna go through and see what's worth uh, possibly bending today. There's some stuff here we managed to catch on film, and then some other stuff we picked up quick time with just some reel to reel. There might be some footage. Uh, yeah. Yeah. No, I don't think was. Can't remember. That was just like. There was two people there. Patch Nagger quite a bit snow shit. This is not battery we operated. Just, we, were <laughs> <laughs> we were literally just walking back to the car and I saw that one. Does it function? That. I mean, there's a little example up there on the top shelf of what that might become. What have we got? Yeah, we've got pictures of this on our Instagram. 
Yeah. yeah. Nah. Not the baby worms. PSS 360. Right. Which is interesting because it's got that little digital synthesizer part where you can affect the envelopes and stuff. Yeah. And then. <laughs> picked up straight vintage and it's got a cassette in it is it vhs i think there is a vhs still in there we should <laughs> so we've got to try and switch it on and we should maybe plug it in see what's in this what's video, in. Plug it in yeah has it got a screen on it no sure no it's a, it'll be a viewfinder thing won't it what sort of outputs do they have it'll be a fucking this is older than both of us <laughs> 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 yeah, it's definitely not about HDMI. It's a fucking relic. That's a point. <laughs> yeah. Um, what do we take on first? Like, what do we? Should we start, start trying to see if stuff works? What can we actually test? And um, pause the video. Let's just plug some shit in and see if we might put some batteries and stuff. Yeah. Let's see what works. What can we test? Like, I think that will be. That should, a, I think that's got batteries in it when we bought it. It's got a speaker. Oh, really? <laughs> that sounds works. nice in itself. <laughs> <laughs> so that, that's a, a good one. Yeah. In one of these corners, it'll be the metal cylinder that controls the motor speed of that tape. So that one's easily stripped down. We'll uh, keep this speed bend done. Keep this in a bendable pile. This one would be the one possibly. Put some batteries in this. Um, I've not got any hope for this thing because there's no analog signal for TV anymore, is there? All right, there we go. Ooh, some fuzz. Oh, we're gonna be able to make a simp out of this, man. <laughs> it's already making little chirpy noises. Yo, this hands. Yo, this thing's gonna take off in a minute. It's making spaceship noises. Is there an audio output on it anywhere? Yeah, it's up. Let's plug it in. sound and little pops out of this. I think we should open this. That's a sweet little Walkman now. Yeah. It's beat up. It looks like it's just whack in the corner of a corner. Oh it's broken. Look. Oh yeah. That corner snapped off. sound than most of the yeah. tape players we've got. I've got loads of ideas for this bursting through my head right now. I don't know what that bit means. The buttons are kind of cool. Yeah. Straight away. Take this off, so we keep that little ribbon intact, and then we can spur off onto little pots, so that we can have the uh, filters. Well, it's an EQ, but it still works like a band, not a band pass, but it's a high and low pass filter, mm -hmm. to some degree, isn't it? And surely we're potentially on that ironic, that we're going beyond. Yeah, I think that's a wicked little one. Mm -hmm. It's one of the better ones that we've picked up. Because yeah, we've got a bunch of dictaphones, but no like proper Walkmans. Too fitty. With batteries. 
We give him his headphones back as well. Which <laughs> one? <laughs> this was the ultimate find, wasn't it, really? We got Stanley's card, who's the name of the guy who sold us this. Gonna get more stuff. Um, he basically said he's got a lockup that's half full of old test equipment. This thing, we looked it up online and the only other one I found was in a museum. <laughs> we don't know enough about this We thing. don't know nothing about it, to be honest. <laughs> He said it come out of a rocket lab. <laughs> Stan might be pulling our leg. But it's vintage. And this thing can be... It's so heavy. What about the guitar pedal? Yeah, because this stuff, we haven't even tested it. She's alive! She's experimental. Um, let's put something in it then. How has it got? <laughs> yes, <sir. laughs> now we're fucking. It's like a guitar. Yeah. Nice. Leave it on that one. Yeah. <laughs> it literally sounds. It's that guitar element, yeah. Yeah, well. Nice. Not bad for, what, four quid or something I paid for it? Yeah. Yes, that's some good sounds. Like that. Yeah. Not yeah. bad at all. Do we look at the port sound? The beast. This was one that we had to just grab. Because it was that it was a really crap day, and it was the end of the day. And we were literally walking back to the van. Final little walk through. Look at the state of it. <laughs> that was that rainy day when we, there was only like two lanes. Of the whole boot sale. It's minging. You know the truth. Oh. Six sounds straight away. <laughs> that volume. Oh. Oh, crispy volume. Yeah, it's a bit of a crispy switch there. Oh. It's just sounding uh, very not easy on the Oh, that speaker is it's horrible. Yeah, plug it link, out. link it up. Simp, basically. I feel like we could change the attack by putting these on different rubby pots. Mm. It's got that clickiness as well, isn't it? it sort of slots into the effect rather than fades. Tried to get 15 and he was like, it's an hour. No. The batteries. What's this and the power? Nice. Right. Visual out. Oh man, it's an aerial. Oh, what? Put it underneath. <laughs> <laughs> Tied it together so no one can nick it. Oh, uh, this is also the out. She's in. This. I right, hit the operate switch. No, I think this has got to be on. It is switched on. It on. Yeah. yeah. But I put it on standby on the end. Operate. Oh, 
Right. Per rate. Right. The GoPro want to be the first to look through the lens. Just see if... <laughs> yeah, I can see all, all the lens and a flickering screen at the end. I love it. <laughs> all right, so that's... Oh, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Close it again, I want to see that. <laughs> Press eject. I'm surprised it didn't pop out like fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Holy moly, look inside there. No. Oh. It's spinning. I press play. It's playing. Oh, it's gone fuzzy. Where's the ring go? <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> First episode. <laughs> Well, that's definitely a project for another day. Yeah. If I can try to get these batteries charged or something, try to film something ourselves. Yeah, because it'd look cool if we could use it to film. Yeah, I think it's spiced a little bit of kit. Quick start though, what do you reckon we actually bend today? I think the Walkman would probably be most rewarding. Or the TV thing. I reckon we do that. Open up these two. Yeah, you can open one up each. Sweet. We'll explore these two guys then. Oh, <laughs> screws. Yeah. Oh, that sounded dodgy. Sizzling, now it's more to the point. Have a look if any of the caps are bulging. It smells like glue, not electrics. Seems fine enough, a little sizzle. A little sizzle. I'm, I'm guessing this is the sound part over here. Included that one needs a bit more research. <laughs> or yeah. Every, uh, everything we touched made it sizzle. So <laughs> <laughs> it still works, but it was sizzle. Yeah, I think you need to figure out how to get that other hinge off. It's loose now, but. Sliders work then. <laughs> That's brilliant. Wherever we mount that, is it? I reckon before even opening it, solder, bang, 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 bang. New wires on, keep them in place, but add extra cable, and then we just test it out. 
with a few different value potentiometers. It's a good start. One down. <laughs> the last order on that one. If we trim these off, slide it in, this will be permanently fixed here and whatever mods we do get built into it and the finished thing will look like that, like a, sli a slid out. Does it look trashy? Does it look cool? I like that front. <laughs> Nothing attached. Nice. Sweet. Right, just a quick roundup so you know where we are. We've got the Walkman here opened up and we've uh, extracted the EQ, which looks like a mini mixer right now. Um, we've also put in a speed mod, which is like on a 10K part. Um, we've got a second mod, which is more like texture. It goes straight into the EQ. Yeah, it does some weird sonic movements. I don't know what exactly yet. But, but something. Sounds like something. And then we got our little... Uh, 
momentary stop. back in where it originally was with EQ. This could go there. Yeah. That's pretty rad. I think that's cool but like <laughs> as it is it's just that. Yeah. <laughs> we broke the front of that tape case. Here in loads of little bits. <laughs> that dream's over. That bit. <laughs> <laughs> so, work around. We thought tape, tape cassette case, an actual case, and a bit of carbon, which we've cut to size. Roughly, we'll have it mounted like that, or like that, that way, and then you can open it, and all the bits will be in the box down here. And we'll mix it, EQ thing. But we're moving on. This is done. Yeah. We are on this now, and we're at the mounting pots and switches stage. I think it looks more sleek like that. It does, and it will fit with our little carbon series. little nib for what? that what's that little what's nib it for because it always gets in my way and I have to cut them off because otherwise it sits off centre <laughs> then there there's one not the right one but it fits It's that <laughs> one millimeter is that ten mil a little down. Yeah. It's coming together there. That'll go there. And that'll be all mounted in nice. It's cool right now, right? 
It's looking pretty smart. stuff in it. You can see it's sort of a mishmash of wires in there, but they're oh. all going to be solid. That all gets trimmed down. Um. It's done. Almost. <laughs> well, let's talk. Like, first thing uh, changes from what it's going to be. It's going to be sand it at the edges <laughs> so the carbon fiber looks smoother it'll get another clear coat so you won't see any of them little blemishes yeah <laughs> this needs to be properly mounted but that's no biggie at the moment it's a bit loosey goosey this part needs to be changed because it's uh not affecting it in the way that it was when we were just going straight from circuit to circuit needle what oh yeah <laughs> Try out. Yeah, let's switch it on. Press. Which one is it? This one? Be, be roundy. Um, one. There's many. Oh, right. I was going to say they're all big roundy. the stop button like have it quite fast and then press the stop button I like that part of it. 
think the original water one was nice looking like it was old. It was old like we've got we got pictures of it. We yeah. got pictures of it because we just destroyed it. So when it's finally finished, it'll be posted on our Instagram and we'll be fiddling around with it and stuff. And it'll get used in our ambient stuff as well. Yeah, sure. Oh, what does it look like next to its carbon brother? They lose. Together, <laughs> I'm pleased with that build, that's fucking sick. Yes, boy. <laughs> <laughs> that's <laughs> fucking the end. <laughs> it took us forever to build it. Not, not actually forever, it only know. took two days, like in reality. It's some tricky stuff. Tricky How stuff. How many hours did you say that build was? Yeah. No, oh, we we're filming everything on Friday, yeah. So We've we done this spend... in like four hours. Yeah, four hour build. Including fucking snapping the other one that we were building in half. So, so yeah, tight. Boom. <laughs>